Happy Friday. It is March the 8th when we are filming this and I want to walk you through something. I'm going to tell you a little story. I hear a lot of people talking about interest rates right now and they're hovering around the sevens. And if you've been here for a while, you know that that is a historically average interest rate. But let's talk about the two paths that one person can take. Now, when is the best time to plant a tree? Well, 20 years ago, with trees behind me. Second best time, today. So let's talk about getting to your dream home and what that looks like. So two paths this one person can take and how it would end up today and how that translates into today's market. So first person, 2014, they bought a $400,000 house at a 4% interest rate. And in 2015, they bought a truck. And by now it's paid off. But today they're in that same house and they're like, you know what? Same truck, I want a new car. I want something shiny and beautiful. So I'm gonna go buy a brand new Tesla, $100,000 car, and I'm gonna finance 90,000 of it at 8% for five years. And so now my total payment between my mortgage and my car is gonna be $4,804 a month got an $1,800 car payment. That's the reality of a lot of people, but they really want that sexy vehicle. Now let's take the second person. They started out exactly the same. In 2014, they bought that $400,000 house at 4%. So their mortgage is $3,194 and they have that 2015 truck that they paid off. So what do they do today? Well, that same house that they bought is now worth $800,000. So what do they do? They put it up for sale and they take the money and the equity from it and they move it over as a down payment to their dream house that is $1.1 million. Now they still have their 2015 truck, but they finance the $1.1 million home at 7% interest rate, which is the today about what it is. It's actually a little lower. And yet their mortgage payment now is $4,460 per month. So it's actually cheaper for them to own a $1.1 million house today at 7% interest than it is for them to have bought the $400,000 house and financed the $100,000 car today. So where do you wanna end up when we're talking about this again in a couple of years? Well, the only path that you have to getting your dream home is to start today with your first home or your next home and move up through creating equity and wealth in owning property. So let's talk about our local market and see where are you? What can you afford? What's out there? Well, new listings are up, which is great news. We need inventory. 2,256 new listings in the past seven days with a median list price of 427.5, and those are averaging four bedrooms, two baths. Now, what about back on the market? 463, three bedrooms, two baths, 375 median price point, and that is where when you're working with an agent, if you're looking for a deal, it says back on the market homes and there's some opportunity there. So expired popped up a little bit, 526, four bedrooms on median on those, 389, 949 was the median list price, 87 days on market, which is interesting. They were definitely testing the market and there was clearly a uh, <laughs> lipstick on a pig problem there. Uh, price decreases. How many re price reductions did we see? Quite a few. 1,296. Three bedrooms, two bath median on those. 378, 750 is the median list price on those. And guess what? Only 36 of the 1,296 actually went pending because of that price drop. So what does that mean? Opportunity for you as a buyer. Somebody has priced high and is now having to come to reality, there is opportunity there. All right, active under contract, 788, three bedroom, two bath median on those, list price 400,000. So those ones that are well-maintained, updated and look good, those are going under contract, a little bit smaller square footage on average, higher price. Pending, 1,655, three bedrooms, two bath, 399.9 is the median list price on those. Closed, 1,798, three bedrooms, two baths, medium price, 400,000 list, drum roll for average sales price, 400,000. 100% sales price to list price. Guys, I told you a month ago, we'd be back here faster than 
uh, people would realize and we got back real fast, real fast to 100% sales price to list price with an average days on market of only 23. So is there opportunity in the market? Yes. Do you wanna be in your dream home? Then start today with your first home or your next home and reach out to me if you have any questions and how the economy is impacting our market. Have a fantastic weekend and we'll be back next week.